Well, hello everybody and welcome back to IWD Crime Pain Show 207. I'm the head announcer, Ivan Toby here, also the IWD World Champion. Oh yeah, undisputed by the way. Next to me is, yeah me, I'm Lee, I'm the legend. Lee legend. And uh, next to him is none other than... Supernova Timmy. And for some reason, Strike's getting in the ring. He unfortunately lost 50% of the company. Jess Lonsy with 50. Let's see what he has to say. Here comes Strike, he's grabbing the mic now. What do you got to say, boy? Ladies and gentlemen, the showstopper here tonight, Striker, the main event, the icon. And after last week where I got the main event and unfortunately it's screwed up thanks to Okada getting hurt and screwing my match up, I'll have to give you, Jess, basically you got the better part of the show, unfortunately. On paper, I had it, but sometimes you can't compensate for stupidity, can you, Okada? Anyway, let's get back to the, the situation. Everything's on the line at next pay-per-view, so into that time, we've got to stay out of his way. So we have came to agreement. The opening two matches tonight are mine. The main event is Jess's. We've also, because technically I added somebody uh, to one of her matches, she's allowed to do it to mine. And then we flipped a coin, and basically, next show, completely Jess's. I'm not allowed to interfere whatsoever, and I get the fourth show, the go-home show. And we're going to do a little competition. Even though we got on a win... Me and Gwen are going to win it next pay per view and have 100% of this company. It should be nice to show I was better at this than Jess. So I will give her 1 0 right now. But after tonight, it's going to be 2 0 in ratings. And then after the next show, hers is going to bomb versus my show. So then it's going to win 2 1 to me. Then I go to pay per view, clean sweep, take that title off her, take that company off her, take Avatopi's title. And me and Gwen are going to walk out. The new owners. I have 100% to me or 50 50, me and Gwen. Me, the world champion, and fingers crossed, Gwen, the women's. I'm only saying fingers crossed because, of course, as we already know, Jess is going to be defending against Ruby beforehand. So if she loses the title, that means she gets out of the embarrassment of losing it overall to my wife. <laughs> now let's start my show. Hit the credits now. You're talking about anything, my title striker. I'm the champ. Oh, yeah, I grew some another Tiffy. You might have it all because you could be losing it since you're a retired wrestler and, and seriously hurt and you shouldn't even be in the ring. Thanks, Lee! Well. Lee, shut up! Yeah, I'm a Lee legend. Here's the opening credits. Well, hello there. Welcome to Avatopia's Wrestling Domination. This is Chronic Pain Show 207. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The game is Poison X, currently in early access on Steam, where you can buy it. As you can see by the link on the screen, me, Avatopia, and my wife, who is going to be helping out with this, has nothing to do with the game other than buying it and playing it and enjoying it. Same goes for any Fire Pro Wrestling World gameplay that might be used in this video. The link for them is also from Steam, above on the screen. And also, I would like to add, the opening music you can hear right now is from the title screen from the Pro Wrestling X game itself, as well as being written by Douglas Patrick. Check out his YouTube and hope you enjoy the show. So being match tonight is Wild Style, Von Camp and Tower and Griffin. Uh, this is Strike, Striker segment and IW Tag Team Towers on the line. Uh, opportunity, sorry. And then we strike a segment again. We've got Gwen Strike of Coles and Abby Jones. Woo, Abby! Ch Lee, shush! Main event, Jess's uh, segment. Oh, Gary and Ruby. It's going to be good. And here comes Griffin, people. So Gary and Ruby main event in. And this match, I believe the winner gets to pick the tag team uh, opponent. Sorry, the, the tag team partner, sorry, that's pay per view. To go against Bryce and, of uh, course, Pyrodine, the tag team champions. But, oh! And we're getting word Striker's got something else to say in the back. Let's see what this is about. Here's Striker again. I says more than likely the head announcer have a Toby probably screwed up the introductions for the, my matches. I don't really care about the main event, because Jess in charge of that. We have Griffin taking on none other than the Tower. Taking on none other than the Wild Styling himself. Wild Style. And taking on none other than Von Count. Basically. The winners of this amazing games match, baby five stars guys, I'm putting my faith in you, will get a tag team tag show against Bryce, the worst, and Pyro, Dingy Wingy. And they get to pick a part of their choice, part of their choosing, and make it count. Then I thought I need something to guarantee a five star. And I'm not scheduled to wrestle tonight, I thought, you know, I'm back from the injuries, I need to take it easy a little bit. So I thought, oh, we have Jason, but then I thought, wait a minute, you know who needs a warm up who's been kept on TV for a while? Because a certain Garay had been trying to keep the best of the best away from titles. None other than Gwen Stryker. So, she wants an opponent. So I said, who do you want as an opponent? And she goes, give me Abby. Abby Jones is one of the hardest hitters out there. So if I'm getting back in the ring, I need to get back in there with one of the best in the company. The cream of the crop. We don't really have that, unfortunately, other than me, myself. So that has to be Abby Jones, the next best thing. So that's who you've got. 
And Gwen's gonna make sure it's a five star match for you people. And that's gonna win me the weight and war. Then you're gonna get that pathetic main event that Jess is gonna put together. Ruby and Gary. That's not a five star match. That is just you trying to punish your mother and to get Gary to beat her down. Nothing more, nothing less. You're not thinking of ratings. You're thinking about your own personal self as self, like normal. That's why you cannot be a good owner here. That's why I'm going to win this competition. Why I'm going to defeat you and your partner. I have a Toby in the next pay per view. By the way, you two even ain't really actually going out anymore. Are you dating? Are you sleeping around with other people? With you, you probably are, but you're like zone for everyone else. I'm your Jess, because that's all you are good for, after all. <laughs> Ouch, that had to yeah, that uh, hurt. That is not on. Jess is not sleeping around with other people. I could rumba. Yeah, Ivan, how do you know? What do you mean? What do you say laugh for? I think so. Know. Yeah, exactly. How do you know? Have Why you. Been? No. What are you talking about? Sure. What are you talking about? And, and Lee, why are you looking all shifty? I'm not. Okay, weird. Anyway, to the match. Here we go, Wildstar's climbing out. If he wins this, he gets to pick his own tag team partner. And obviously, he's not going to win because he's flying through the air and he just smashed his face with his own knee. Yeah. That had to hurt. That was a wild knee! Wild knee! Okay, Lee, calm down. Calm down, please. He keeps trying to make up catchphrases. Why? When I'm the master of catchphrases. Okay. What is your catchphrase? Whatever that comes out of my brain and my head at the time. It's not a catchphrase. It's catchphrase. It's something that is repeated for every show. Yeah, but, but when they come up so well and so fresh, everything becomes a catchphrase, and then you move on to the next one. See? It's that simple. You don't know what a catchphrase is. Yes, I do. Oh, my God. Yes, I do. Who's the greatest of all time? Avatopia. Yeah, there, catchphrase. catchphrase. That's, that's a catchphrase. It's a great one. Anyway, whilst Ty trying to sneak out again, but if Von Kant yeah, taps, yeah. Griffin's going to win. We're going to the battle. This is a pre-recorded from Von Kant himself. And I guess we can hear from you as soon as I tell you what's your thoughts on this since you're your know, like hyphen boyfriend, the Griffin's in there. Or, or is that supposed to be either of them? Again, I don't know who between you two anymore. I hear Stryker mouthing off like normal. And the facts are facts. Stryker's a lot of talk and he doesn't see greatness in other people, even when it's there and it's smacking him in the face. And he's lucky that he's not wrestling tonight because if he was and he was in the ring with me, greatness would be smacking him in the face. And you can count on that. And for this match, one more thing you can count on is quite simple. Me winning it, then I'll go after the round and find myself a partner who is worthy to be called, basically, Von Cal's partner. So we will then go on to beat Bryce the Idiot and, what, Pyro the Doggy? Since, basically, Doggy Treats and he's ding ding ding. Is that him's barking? I don't know. But you just count on me going for them titles and winning them. That's simple. And we're back. We've Von Count got his face smashed in, as we said, so you count on that to happen this match, too. See? That's a good catchphrase right there. That's not a bad catchphrase, but ain't the count on thing Ivy Toby actually Von Counts? Um, Shut up, Lee! What was that about? What was that about? You know what? What? You just want to drop kids to tell his face? Griffin <laughs> is my best friend. I thought I was! What the hell? Fine. But then again, you basically did the whole He's thing my with Jess. second best friend. Exactly, and what's that whole thing about you? <laughs> See, that's just getting you back. Anyway. You know that I love Ivan. You know, yeah, exactly, you screwed me over so much for it. At the point now you're my kid because of it, you love Ivan so much. Okay, here goes. What? One count. What? But I what? That you're my kid now, you love him so much. I do love him. Okay. We were in a... We were on a break! Okay, if you say so. Oh, kick out, kick out! Uh, you two, shouldn't you be focused as our personal lives is on the match? Just. Lee, shut up! Oh, sorry. Yeah, lie. Triple L. Why are you calling Triple L anyway? What's that about? Oh, what's this? Gary in the back. Why is he calling Triple L quick? Because of Lee Legend Legend. Tonight, I get my hands on Ruby. Oh, Lee, going in my ring. I am going to destroy her. A new time. <laughs> and one thing, don't think I forgot. Why she was with me, Dane? You took what was mine. I'll be coming for you next. And the beat and just my broken. <laughs> Must be <laughs> idiot, get here. <laughs> what the? Oh, he just saw Dane walk past was doing an interview and he attacked him. So he blames Dane for for Ruby splitting on him. But I think Ruby is that manipulated. She was going to do that anyway. Yeah. Dane was unfortunately a victim of her plowing her way to the top. Well, at least he gets beat up Ruby tonight. But no, well you were gone. We wouldn't shut up with catchphrases. So That's I because him... I'm good at them! Because I'm Lee Legend. 
What, what was that, Lee? Seriously, what was that? What was what? That's his catchphrase. How's that a catchphrase? It's just saying your name! And not only that, you're throwing in t the legendary Teodor. See, that's a catchphrase. Legendary Teodor in that. I didn't mention Teodor. That's then how are you name. legend? My name is Lee Legend. Yeah, it's again, how are you a legend? That's, that's my last, last name! name. Okay, whatever. To be legendary, you got to earn it like I'm getting there and Teodor is. You are not legendary. As we see Gary in the back taking Dana Path, it seems. That's my last name, seriously. Yeah, of course it is. Of course it is. Here, Lee. Pat Don't pat me on the head! Oi, who's head announcer here? Okay, sorry. Thank you. Okay. And plus, I'm the world champion. Yeah, I know. But you're not going to keep it very long, are you? What was that? Nothing. What did you say? To no. He didn't say anything. Okay, I thought you're my best friend, not his. What's going on here? And, oh, they, uh, we need, yeah, I believe, yeah, 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 I'm getting the word, they are trying to separate him in the back now, pulling him off Dane. And we have a bloodbath in the ring, it seems. But yes, that's why I gave him the nickname Triple Up. Because I'm Lee, legend. The legend. Okay, do you have a nervous tick there? Why do you keep doing that? That's his thingy. That's his shtick. That he won't stop, which is why I called him Triple L. So that he would. Yay! Lee, legend, dick. Okay, stop doing that. Okay, kick out! Is one count on the count? Oh, so we can tower? Oh, where's the back? Where's the tower? Oh, this is pre recorded. No, oh, well, so there we go. Once again, I'm in the ring with that idiot, that stupid, pathetic guy who calls himself a wrestler. <laughs> I can see Tolls that wrestle better than you, Griffin. And that's why tonight, the redemption's coming your way, and I get to destroy you one last time before I pick myself a great partner to go on and win the tag team titles. As for you, Wildstyle, you're the same level as Griffin. You came from the same competitions a year later, less experience. Hell, you're still in your diaper, your nappies all the time. That's what that black thing is. Because you have not got some grown up pants yet, or grown up tops yet. Because you are wild. After all, wild as a baby. <laughs> I crack myself up. And as for you, Von Count, the only person in that ring that's actually can give me a run for my money in there. Because you've actually got some guts and some ability behind you. Unfortunately for you, you're in there with me. And that means the redemption wave is waving over you. And I am towering over everybody to victory tonight. And one last thing. I do agree with you, Striker, with the legs open part for Jess. That's all she was ever good for. She was good at sucking up, if you know what I mean. Why do you think I kept her by my side when I was in charge for so long? So Gwen, all I have to say for it to you, keep your eyes open on her because after she loses the company at the pay-per-view, she might be trying to suck up to the new owner, your husband. <laughs> What the hell are you talking about? Stop bad mouthing Jess right now. This is bull rubbish. Bull rubbish. If you were in that cage, I'd be in there beating you down again, like I did the first time we got in the ring. Remember who won? Remember the jam. That's right. The jam is here, and he beat you. And, okay, why are you climbing out? Uh, okay, stay back in the ring. Stay in the ring. Aha, you fell. Aha. Come and get some, so you can't take me. Ha. Um, Jim yeah. uh, what's going on with Atopia? Just leave him alone. It's one of his nervous ticks. Oh, okay. What do you mean I don't have a nervous tick? They go wild style? Crashing and burning people? No offense, but wild style and tower are wearing the exact same thing, except... Exactly, that's how stupid tower is! You know what I like? You're stupid tower! You're stupid! The yellow brain don't have one because you're stupid! <laughs> okay, is he still doing that? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. No, try to stay out of his way. He seems a bit agitated today. He's I am not on hinge. I am the champion! The head announcer, either. Topia! See, there's a catchphrase for you. I have a Topia! And we have Wildstar on the back. Pre record, what's easy to say? Now, here comes him wilding. I am wild style. I'm not a baby wearing a nappy. I am not a basically idiot. I'm sick of people looking past me. I'm sick and tired of late of my girlfriend keeping me in the doghouse saying you can't do anything right. Well, the thing is, you haven't either. Are you gonna tap when this around your waist right now? No! Have I got the world? No! We're both basically down and dumped together. So let's stick together, not push each other apart. Let me get a victory tonight. Then you keep them boots on and we celebrate. And then we focus on you getting that women's belt, what you deserve. And then boots stay on and we celebrate again. And we celebrate night in, night out, night in, night out, night in, night out. 
and we'll be styling and profiling you, Griffin. You want to be in the ring with me? You cannot handle the wildness. You von count. You can't even count to three. A mind count past me. And as you tower, I will spear straight through your bottom, your base, and you will come crumbling down and crashing and burning. And I am going to win tonight. Well, good job, von count doesn't need to count to three. Only the ref needs to count to three, you idiot. I caramba. You can't count past me. And we're going to have the boots on and off, all that. Okay, you're really Shall moody we? today, aren't you? You're really moody. I am not moody. I am the champion. Are you jelly? I'm not a piece of jelly. Oh my god, you're jelly. I'm not jelly. You're jelly if he takes his, keeps his boots on or off. I don't care what he wears with his boots. I missed Von Count. He didn't even move. I don't care if he has his boots on or off. And I believe it was about Tanya's boots, not his. Who's ever? You're jelly. I am not jelly. Why am I jelly? Two. Wow. Like I went on that date with Jess, we've not really communicated since. So that's why she's moved on. What do you mean she's moved on? Tanya's moved on, and you technically still have it. I, I'm t I said Jess, not Tanya, what are you saying? I said I went on a date with Jess, as you saw a few weeks ago, we're not really communicating. Yeah, exactly, and she's moved on with Wild Style. I'm not talking about Tanya. I don't care you about that. Jealous. I'm not jealous. I've just been going through a lot of hell away in this company with everybody. Wow, what a move! Bang! Basically getting at me, attacking me, attacking Jess, end up in the hospital repeatedly. You know, I've had most of this week in hospital, most of last week in hospital. Well, there's these constant attacks, and here is Griffin. Let's see what the yeah, idiot has to say. Your talk is how much of a loser I am. After all, my record is not spectacular. But that's why I'm the hardest grabbed in the business. I will kick and fight, punch and crawl and climb. You name it, I'll do it to get to the top and prove I deserve that spot to prove I'm better than the rest of you. I'll do it for every fan out there and of course the sexy Sue Tiffy who will be out there at ringside watching me and I know she's supporting me and I can get the job done. I just gotta get through you while style, gotta get through you Von Count and of course that arrogant idiot tower who I can't wait to knock that smirk on her face with these fists. And when that's done, I get to pick a tag team partner. Hell, if she wasn't already pregnant and couldn't wrestle, it'd be sumo tick, I'd be guaranteed in tag titles then. Unfortunately, she can't wrestle, so I had to find someone else suitable and go on to become the new tag team champions. Or they'll defeat Bryce, the best. I don't think you're the best. Most people don't, but yet, you are on top of the mountain right now. You are one of the tag team champions, so maybe there is something that name. And as for your partner, he is like a dog. He sicks on you as you go with attack and all that. Well, I'm going to basically kick him in the face if he tries. And then me and my partner are going to go on to win the tag team titles. Just got it through tonight. Mm. And we're back. I would have accepted too. If you say so. What The things you wouldn't have to because he's not going to win. Oh, oh. Wildstar's well, going to win. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, Tyler's throwing him. Tyler's flung him off. Oh. oh Holy fuck! What the hell did Tower just do? Just flung Wildstyle off as Griffin was falling, I believe, from uh, Von Count. And then in the process, Wildstyle was slammed into Von Count. And Tower just won. And now we get to pick a tag partner for the tag titles. I did, did not see on? that coming. What? How did he hold on? He flung him. Did you see the way he shoved his shoulders into him? Wildstyle had that one then. I don't like Tower, but I have to admit that was an absolutely amazing move. There, uh, you get your clap. I would have just went like this. That says he's mouthing off. What's your no, thoughts, Lee? Can I talk about it? Yeah, we're going for my free plays. Oh, great, great! That was an amazing move by Tower. That was one of the best moves I've ever seen. Did you see how he just shoved his shoulder? Lee, just come. You said I could talk. I guess. Yes! Like and then he struck him off his shoulder, he went flying down, smashed them all. Look at his replays, he goes flying through the air. The fact that he had the strength and the whereabouts, the brain power to do it after this. We're still an RKO there. RKO. Yeah, this is away flying again, so did Griffin. Griffin was flying through the air, but he had wings, 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 clucked. Yes! And here goes Wild Style, he almost had a good match. Almost, almost, but not quite! Not quite! And this is where Griffin was going, but then he had a double whammy of Wild Style and Tower Power. And that stopped that. And then we saw an RKO, and I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe this is where it happens. Look, watch this, he just turns and smashes him in the legs as he flies. He ends up hitting Griffin, and Von Count the way down, climbs out, wins the match, said and done. 
Writes his name all over. Their winner might yeah, be next jack champion. Could have won it if he didn't do the little flippy thing at the top. Well, he took his uh, fingers out. And, of course... Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's over. So the next part is Gwen Stryker taking Abby Jones. This is a Stryker segment, people. Here we go. Okay, so... What, why is Ruby coming out? She's not scheduled. I said Gwen Stryker and Abby. Yeah, Maybe yeah. this is the interfering match. What? what? Jess would not put Ruby in the match randomly to start off. Oh, she's grabbing the mic. Oh, there we go. I'm out here for one simple reason. Jess, you're such a bad daughter. I gave you everything, and I'm the greatest mother in the world, and you treat me like dirt. You tried to fire me last week, making me strip for these people. They don't deserve to see me. And I'm the first ever IWD woman to ever become the IWD world champ. You don't treat me like that. And you have no guts, that's why you put me in the ring with Gary. Or it shows your jealousy of me. Or how petty you are with forcing me tonight to go one-on-one -on -one with Gary. You should be ashamed of yourself, you coward. And as for you, Ivatopia, maybe let me take a seat. What do you mean you think I'm a coward? How's this then? I will change tonight's match. Instead of you one-on-one -on -one with Gary, it's going to be Gary teaming with me. Versus you and a partner of your choice, and the winning side gets to pick the stipulations for our next pay-per-view match. So in other words, our title match at the next pay-per-view, you and me, one on one. Winner gets to pick the next stipulation for the match. How's that for a coward? Ah! <laughs> Why are you saying here? What? Ow! What the? Move over for a lady. Why don't you be a gentleman instead of? Because there's no ladies out here. The way you. Why? Do you want to be hit in the head again? No. And, and <laughs> Dame Gods is attacking Jess as we speak, and she just basically Good. made the main event hurting Gary versus you in a part of your choice. I was going to have things down the throat. Uh, and basically, whoever wins the stipulation will get to pick a stipulation for your match at the pay per view. You think I know who my partner is right now? Okay, good for you. So you came out here to basically bait her, but she's still going to destroy you after. Oh, get to her head! <laughs> Come, somebody needs to stop this! Why are you being so mean? You weren't that way the other night! Talking about- Add one half of the greatest tag team of all time, not only the world in anybody's history. I decided to watch this match to see which jabroni is going to be my next victim. Or should I say, the best is victim, and of course, Pyro Ding. Ding, 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 calm it down, dingy wingy. Oh, granite last try, you got me seeing dingy wingy now. I didn't mean that. I stabbed you, bit my hand. Okay, you're not a dingy wingy. You are Pyro Ding, and where we're already here. Here's a lovely doggy tree. Come on, come on, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. As you can see, he's raring to go. Rip off anyone who gets in our way. I'll do victory because we're the tag team champions, and I am Bryce, the damn best. Remember now. Okay, that's great from uh, uh, Bryce, but I believe uh, Demon God is still tacking Jess. I need, I need to go. No, honey. Hey, you what you doing? Can you lay off my lap? What you doing? I need to get to the back. You, you are the head announcer, you should probably stay and call this match. Uh, fuck, fine. But you get attacked in the back. And please get your leg off my lap. Anyway, with the Abby in the ring. I like putting my legs up. Yeah, we know that for it sure. It increases the circulation. Anyway, Abby just took the Gwen down. Gwen is not doing very well in the ring. I know, uh, Abby's awesome. Go, Abby! Okay, Lee, calm down. Okay. So oh, get to Abby face. and Lee get married, would her last name then be Abby Legend? I don't know, but we have a pretty cool in the back. Let's go to it now. So today, I've got an exhibit match, and I needed to pick an opponent. And like Shriker said earlier, my wonderful husband, I need somebody who's the cream of the crop. And unfortunately, that's Abby. So I chose her to make an example of tonight. Before I go on and win the women's title, assuming again that Stryker always pointed out that Jess isn't the coward she is and drops the belt beforehand, which I think she's going to. 
<laughs> After all, the demon goddess is already mad that she wouldn't give her a title shot when she shut up and she's all peeved from before. So that's what happened. Okay, good for you. You're basically trying to beat Abby, but Abby's beating you up instead. And why don't you take your legs off my finger? If you should have got underwear on, what the hell? Why are you looking? <laughs> Not looking. <laughs> Do you like what you see? No, Mr. I don't. Topia? Well, I ain't fair. Why is you sat next to him in between us? I can't see nothing. Anyway. Lee, I don't think you'd want to see that. Yeah, you don't, Lee. You don't. And we're going to battery recorders. Striker, Gwen. The Strikers, I don't care if you're in charge now. Or half in charge, whatever. You both think you're so superior and you're the top of this company and nothing can touch you. And on the guy's side, you think Pitbull is the best here, and he's nowhere near, and Gwen, you think you're the greatest woman, and I'm nowhere near. The fact is, you got a rude awakening when I get to knock you out tonight. And after tonight, I'm gonna knock that taste right out of your mouth, you bitch. And then me and Lee will go for round two, wink wink, if you know what I mean. Holy hey, fuck. Hey, Somebody sounds like they might have fun tonight. You were just trying to get a, a view of um, Ruby's un lack of underwear for no reason. And Abby just literally early tonight, well, we just heard, wants to go for round two with you. Wow. Smooth move then. Zach, worst yeah, timing ever. Yeah, Um, it's fine. Yeah, I want the camera on me now. As you can see, my ribs are bust after what happened earlier. But Demon Goddess, you keep attacking me. Guess what? You're wrong. I know you want me to be as fresh as possible. So how about this? You get out here tonight with the match that's ongoing now. And if you win, we'll be the opening match of the next pay-per-view. How about that? Huh? So, what? She said Demon Goddess is in this match now. Oh! I think Gwen just got hurt. You see, she has still a mouth bleeding and all oh, the bandage. Oh, please. She's doing that to get attention. That's what she's good at. Oh, that's Did rich. you see her with her boobs out again? That's rich. Oh, get pain. That's rich coming from somebody who's got the legs on, maybe no underwear on. Why do you keep looking? Do you like what you I see? I do not keep looking. Stop. Would you, would you like, like me off to me? go a little further? No, I do not. Ow, oh, another vicious mood there. And a pain. One, two. I think Gwen's hurting this, by the way, now. But the thing At is, least I don't do it to every guy the way she does. She doesn't do it to every guy. Definitely didn't take that after me. <laughs> she don't take it after you. My she other guy. daughter took it after me the most because she's the most precious little gem there is, and somebody tried to tarnish her. I wonder who that was, Abby. I'm trying to tarnish her. Abby's been eaten alive, and I was trying to say Gwen looks like she's hurt. And this is the first pinfall wins, and if Demon Goddess wins this, she gets us Jess in the opening match in the next pay per view. And then the winner of that will go on to face Ruby, and if you win your match, you'll get to stipulate the stipulation for that match. And then after that, Jess then will be in the main event defending the women's side she's still the champion or and the company. So she's possibly wrestling three times to keep everything in the next pay per view. I caramba. And she's definitely gonna lose one of those. Jess is awesome, she's gonna pull it off. She may be an awesome. Thanks to me, but that doesn't make her awesome. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'd be more awesome if you lean this way a little bit, but I guess you'd say that because Abby. Okay, go Abby! Go Abby! Lady, yes. focus. Okay, I'm Lee Legend. Just because she's got lady bits. Okay, okay. Doesn't mean you need to stick your stuff in her lady bits. I can't anyway. She's basically a back to me. We have her legs on top of her Why speech. don't you focus on your girlfriend's lady bits? We're not girlfriend. We did one time, but she did round two. Maybe we'll come girlfriend after. Boyfriend, I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. and if you keep trying to get Ruby, okay, okay. Oh no, she's a chance. I don't think she's even gonna be ready for tonight. Let's see what's happening to Abby. Oh, well, she's back in the feet. Come on, Abby. Come on, Abby. Go, go, what go. About Gwen, she just kind of lay in there. Well, I ain't being with Gwen after all. It's gonna be with uh, Abby. Who cares? Go, Abby. Go. Woo hoo. That's a bit heartless, early. What? Why? You only about the one you're possibly humping. Uh. Uh. Triple L might be double L in a minute. Uh, uh, Lee Legend! <laughs> to the match! Gwen's running! See, go Gwen, get away! Yay! Take care about Gwen too. Yay, yay! 
Okay, good save. <gasps> I know! Okay. It's not that great of no, a save. No, really, I was being sarcastic. Whatever. Okay, Anchor Lock, come on, make it tap, Abby. Come on, you can do this. Great, Devin, cool. I think the demon goddess has got it, let's be honest. Oh, it's down a throat. Hopefully she does, so that way she can be my little girl up next time. <laughs> and if she does beat your little girl up next time, she would then be in the ring with you defending that title. So she'd get to beat you up too. Oh, Abby's tapped. Yep, she's got the, the match. No, please. Do we go to that other match replay? Oh, I can handle her, but just can't. <laughs> well, we're going to find out, because you've got to get in the ring now and do your actual match. Okay. Hey, I'm Utopia. What? Come here. No, I don't want to come here. What are you talking about? Anchor lock in the match for re replay. You do. Mm -hmm. Get off. Mm -hmm. Stop it. Mm -hmm. Ew, stop it. What are you playing at? Sticking your tongue down my throat. <laughs> and as it's a replay. Really like them apples? Not very much. And as I was saying, as we just saw what happened earlier, it just made the match, made Demon Goddess enter. In his striker segment, but she added Demon Goddess like he did to hers. She came out, destroyed. I, I actually think, think really Abby. likes you. No, she what doesn't. is with you and the awesome I women? got no clue. Anyway, as I was trying to say, I believe Abby actually would have won this one on one with Gwen if Demon hadn't entered. Do you have like a perfume or something? What? No. That just attracts women with the last name Awesome? I don't know. Well, you're pregnant, so you you don't have Awesome in your name. That was a fluke and you know it. My uh, fault, my, my manhood's so strong, or the women flock to me. I've had better. What the hell? You haven't. Shush. I've been better than you. And we have Jess Osmond's segment now. Obviously, Ruby. Did you. Did, 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 I think it was Jason. Jason Lance. Uh, what, what? Why is he doing here? He's not supposed to be, be in any Jess segment, I guess, since she, she said you could pick who you wanted, she picked him. I she, thought she, she would pick Jason. Ruby has, I'm saying. Oh. Jess hasn't. Remember, Jess is not allowed in her segments to pick Striker, Gwen Striker, or Lance. And Striker's not allowed to use her or me. Unless we agree to it. And then nobody can use me because of my baby. Yeah, unless they agree to it. So all I can think is, Ruby asked Lance, they had this planned. They must have. And here comes Jess. She's so got top back on and we got to back. Oh, strike a few, as I say. Yeah, I just found out what happened. I was in the back preparing Jason Lee here, so I wasn't actually watching Gwen's match. So I thought she had 100% on control. And the thing is, she did. Of course. Stupid Jess Awesome had to basically stick her nose in again and, and, and turn the demon goddess into that match. That's the only reason. She was smart. She got out of there after apparently she was destroying her. So that was smart on her. She, yeah, she lost the match thanks to that, but she got out of there. But the stupid thing is now, you Jess, think about it. Open match, you demon goddess, you've lost your title. And then the winner goes on to take on Ruby. Well done, well done. You've managed to get yourself out of the situation where Gwen takes the belt off you. She's still going to take the company off you, but you saved your title from her at least. That's not true. She's going to win both of them and go on and help me win the main event. And you can't take it, Striker. It would be a lot better if I was a company owner. You know, it's basically Jess and Striker right now, but after the pay per view, it? it will be 100% Jess or Jess and me 50%. I could be your new boss. It's not a new day if I'm heading out, so I'm already like your boss, but you know what I'm saying? The actual boss that could fire you. You wouldn't fire the mother of your child, because then how would your child survive? I know, I think Jess would. Okay, oh, Gary, let's see what he said earlier yeah, tonight. Let's see Here comes. Your child. Yes, 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 poor man's damn alley tonight, but he will stay out of my way, because guess what's about to happen, I'm going to have to destroy you, Ruby, and probably my new partner, Jess. The only thing I like about Jess, man, is the fact she was purple, like me, haha, <laughs> team in heaven, I guess. Look, I'm going to destroy you, I'm together, and whoever, she's stupid enough to get on her side. <laughs> please be Dane, please be Dane. <laughs> well, fortunately, well, it wasn't Dane. It's Lance. J Jason Lance, sorry. We saw him debut in Injured Pitbull last pay-per-view, this is the second ever match. And he's on the wrong side of this. He's going to lose tonight to Gary, the insane one, a former leader, a former boss, and of course Jess Olson, the current women's champion and 50% owner of the company right now. That's his knees to getting in there. You know, I, I'm you? worried she does have her, her uh, ribs you. hurt. If Jess does try to fire me, would you stop her? Well, I'll try, if I can, obviously. Obviously, but I have your baby. I know, but she's 100 owner, and I'm not. I, I, I'm saying that. I can tell her, please don't do it, but it's up to her. Oh, pre-recorded back. Here we go. 
I am here to prove how great I am. Every female out there wants me, every guy out there wants me. And guess what? Only the people I say deserve me will get me. And tonight, Ruby needs my help. So I am going to get another victory under my belt and help that wonderful lady tonight destroy Jess and cause her pathetic ex-boyfriend, Gary. <laughs> okay, so first time we've actually heard Jason talk, it seems. Let's see if he is all talk. He, he got a flip victory with Pitbull at the pay-per-view. He really likes Ruby. I wonder if him and Ruby are going to get it on later. I don't know, apparently he likes anything that moves, and she likes anything that moves, so... Go get on swimmingly. Oh, he's giving him a good forking now. Mm -hmm. Okay, Ruby's fighting back here. Ow! Oof. Four on to Jess. She probably really enjoyed that. And Jess enjoyed that kick to the, her lower back. I wonder what oh, she's what was enjoying that? more. Hurting Jess or hurting Gary? I don't know. We're basically trying to tease me out here. Seems like games for her. Oh, we've got a pre-recorded in the back. Sounds like from Ruby. She was out here already. Hello, darlings. As you already know by now, who your opponent is? Jason Lance, that hunk of hunk of burning love man. And of course, we're gonna take down Gary. And then, we're gonna take out what's left of my pathetic daughter and give you the biggest pounding of your life. And let's face it, I know that's going to be hard to do because you're always used to taking on poundings. <laughs> Which I know is going to be very, very rough for you. And just maybe you'll have a blast from the past to really rub it in. After all, I am ashamed of you and you embarrass me. So I'm going to do the same to you. This may be a lot more present than you realize. Ain't that right, Ivatopia? Wink, wink. Don't worry. Jess doesn't mind. She gets around enough anyways. <laughs> What, what the? the? So Sally, what's she doing here? Uh, Avatopia? What? I'm trying to call this match. She shouldn't be in the ring. You might want to look. Her name's Sally. Yeah, look. I said Sally. What? 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 The? what? Um. Whoa! That's. Look at this! You fool! There's Avatopia! He's, he's. Well, naked! I'm Sally! That woman there's on top of her naked! She's. Wow! She's jumping in! And Ruby's on the side. Oh, yeah! She's, oh, wow! She's got nice boobs, hasn't she? Right? I don't remember that. I've been hospital last few weeks. Well, the video for you there, there's a video. <laughs> well, because, like, you've been playing the way with Ruby and the Sally. And when she came out, you said her name. You knew who she was. Avatopia. She's best friend. Avatopia! What? I'm trying to call. What's going on? What's that? We what, what also the? have some explaining to do. What the? What, what the hell? That's, that's Jess. She blindfolded. Hope it Lee. What the hell, Lee? Uh, yeah, that was the other night. She's she, she asking me to come round and, and, and check out a new implant breast, and I couldn't resist. She, she's you, you're too single anyway at the moment. And besides, you hooked Ruby. I, I don't even remember that. I, I don't know what's going on right now. Oh, I have a Tokyo. It kind of looks like they're drunk. What? Yeah, it's probably why well, I don't remember then. I was in hospital. And she is a nurse, isn't she, Ruby? So she probably got Sally in there. But uh, I, how does that explain Jess? I don't know. She's blindfolded, but she's really enjoying it. And look, and look, look at that video of mine. Let me, don't get it on the mic. But yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going Jess, Jess. So I'm thinking Jess is humping me. I'm, I'm completely out of it. They must have drugged me. Mm. But, I, but, but wait. I don't, I don't know why what Why would you do that to Ivatopia, Lee? They're not together! Look at Sally, through the air! And, and no offense, I, I see what you're saying in her eye, but she gave me a good one. I, you, you shut the. Get up! 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 Get She has no excuse. She's enjoying it so much, that video. Like you said, we might get the same with Jug Jokes. Ruby basically took advantage of me with this Sally. 
And I thought it was Jess, obviously, from what I've seen in the video. I don't, I don't know what to do. Oh. And, and Paul said she was be helped defending my title at the pay-per-view, yet she's got herself in all these matches. I thought there was good in, maybe there wasn't. She's been using the whole time. I don't know what to do right now. And she's in there. I do feel like she should be getting hammered like this, but at the same time... Yeah, I guess technically, like Lee said, that they weren't... We're not technically going out yet. Um, but, she knew you liked her. Why would she do that to somebody? I don't know. There's no proof of it, is there? What the... What, 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 you're folding my head face full, Lee. What? These are texts from you and her. Hey, Gary, you attacked me blind time me earlier. Well, I challenge you to the next pay-per-view. Canadian royalty is challenging you, that's right. You and me. You don't get away with blind time Canadian royalty. You want World War Three? Canadian royalty is coming at you. Unless you're chicken. But I know why you're so upset. Because Ruby found a real man, and then after that, she couldn't even look at you. That's why she dumped you quickly. <laughs> True what they say, when I show them my Dane stick, they can't get enough. Um... The dangers of the fear and Gary's at the strat and he's getting hammered by uh, uh, Sally now. Like you did the other day. Shut it, Lee! Lee, you're not gonna help yourself in this situation. You're the one that had sex with Jess. And according to these texts, she basically sent you picture after picture. She really tried to get you from around and see her. Yeah, I know, that's why I couldn't resist. You know when you get these. I know when you get in these pictures, you can't. And Jess is out. And so is Gary. Did you see what just happened? And Sally is being very provocative to Jess. They just lost, so that means Ruby, after basically grabbing her in the vagina, made a tap out, and also grabbed uh, Gary in his groin area, made him tap out. She now gets to pick the stipulations for a match. And as we already said, Jess has already made the match with Demon Goddess. Demon Goddess won hers, so it's going to be the pay-per-view. Open the match. Jess defending the women's title versus Demon Goddess. If some miracle she wins, or the, the winner of that match will go advance to Ruby, who gets to pick a stipulation for her match with the women's title on the line. And then, after that, matter what, Jess will be in the main event, teaming with me, to keep my title around my ways and with the company on the line. Great. You know, I can't do it. I'm, go I'm gone. Just forget this. Well, he, he just looked off. Oh, sorry. Okay, we, we, okay, back to the show, because I'm Lee, legend. Uh, Lee, yeah. you might well not want to do that, because I have a feeling Ivatobi is really close to killing you. But wait, you just left, so. Okay, match replays. As Ivatobi said, she, she got grabbed in the groin area, and it was a sweet groin area, I have to tell you that. Whew. And... Do you want to get pummeled when you get to the back? You can no. just keep it up. No, see, look, the this thing. is where the grabbing area was, and I did a lot of that that night. Woohoo! And then she, she basically gave up on, on it, and she gave up for me, you too. You need to be sensitive. I'm being sensitive. I believe she gives up so when Ruby does it earlier. We see a great double move there. And then the second, see, that, that move by Sally was pretty awesome. And this is where Dane basically distracted Gary, and he then got caught by none other. Yeah, then Gary. And here, here it comes, here it comes, Ruby. Boom! Can you imagine that? Oh, that would be a lovely thing to watch. And boom! And she taps out from it. I made a tap out of what that night, and oh, <laughs> shut it, shut it! Oh, I'm gone. Oh, oh, I'm just going by a train. I told you, oh, shut up. Oh, uh, IWD, pain crime. Like, subscribe, and shows all that good stuff. Like, subscribe. Bye. See I'm super next to time. See next to Lee. Um, That's yeah, a legend. I'm legend. Le legend. Ding, ding. Bye. Bill. Uh, I like to subscribe.
Yeah, I'm trying to get ready for the match. Like I said earlier, as you heard, my ribs hurt. My side hurt. My arm hurts. Basically, I don't care. I'm going to go out there with Gary and we're going to destroy my stupid slut mother and whoever stupid enough to get in the ring with her. It's that simple. Now get out of my way. We've got to hit my music.